I'm Guo Yu Zhong, and uh, in an easy way, just call me Slayer, the nickname. So um, I'm here to bring a small but powerful idea to use. Um, we think that's very easy idea and to put the geolocation into short messaging. This picture is temple in Taiwan. We decided not to sit there and pray for God. We want to do something. So I come here and use my poor English to do the presentation. So um, Open Geo SMS is a tiny standard which includes URL and the geo information and the short messaging itself. So that can easily exchange it among the different uh, uh, mobile device. So uh, just like uh, if you are using feature phone or you are using like a smartphone, you can both receive the short message. But if, if you are using a smartphone, you can even retrieve further information via the URL. So this is a quick example about OpenGL SMS in the red box. So just like if you are in the middle of a cornfield or like a, uh, nowhere, you, you don't even know where you are, just send, send out this kinds of short message. That will auto take the X and the Y in that short message. So this is really helpful when you like, uh, have a language barrier and uh, you don't know uh, where you are or something like that. So just send out that kinds of geotech short message. This is a quick uh, example from my Japanese friend. Uh, he cannot call any taxi in my city, like uh, at late night, because he's from Japan, he don't know Chinese, on the semi, the open geo SMS message. And I went there the, to rescue him and the, get him back to his apartment. That's easy. So we are thinking about to use geo, open geo SMS into like a disaster man management uh, in three major features. That instant report, like this uh, figure. Um, with Yushahidi, you can report the status uh, through the short message. Uh, with OpenGeoSMS, you can further like, locate the X and the Y and send it back to the server along with the geotagging. I think that helps uh, the automatic page, uh, data processing for the server and the more accurate for the location spot. And for the task dispatching, that would be uh, more easier for the rescuing team to go out, uh, receive the re uh, request that you should go there, you should go there, and go out uh, without carrying a paper of note saying X and Y, and you go, go to somewhere. For team communications, that's also an idea about, uh, hey, there's alpha team and beta team, and they want to know each other's location, just to use OpenGeoSMS. So we provide a free and a little tiny application that can uh, collaborate with Shahana that, of course, cover the three major features on that. The reason why we have this small idea is uh, in Taiwan, we also have a lot of disaster going on. This is an, like a 7.3 magnitude uh, earthquake happened in Taiwan. So this kind of disaster will this like a, a landslide or this kind of road damage in Taiwan. So we are thinking about, hey, maybe we can combine that with the Ushahidi application to allow the people report the status back to server. And uh, what's the next step? We collaborate with the navigation service provider. So uh, once the status updates confirmed, the serv navigation service provider can send out the noti notification to the client and the navigation client can do the reroute to avoid that road. Of course, this can also adapt in early warning uh, notification. So either uh, feature phone or smartphone can receive this notification, but the smartphone can e even further bring out more information about this disaster. So this picture uh, shows how many typhoons hit Taiwan in the past 20 years. There's really a lot of typhoon going on <laughs> over there. So what happened after a typhoon hits Taiwan? Like, uh, it, it brings like a frost and the landslide. Uh, there's a small village called Xiaolin Chen. There's about 300 people lives there. After the landslide, psh, everything was gone. That's really a big tragedy in Taiwan. So we also think about uh, how to combine that with uh, satellite image 
imagery request and notified. So we talked to NASA, and he said, OK, just send me the X and the Y that perfectly fit into the scenario. And then uh, after the satellite acquired the image, it will send back to our server, and we will notify that. This open GeoSMS can also collaborate with a lot of various uh, location-based service, pizza delivering and the taxi calling and so on. So uh, we would like to have a further discussion. Uh, we are going to have a like a safe organized uh, discussion tomorrow, and we have a free application for download and a free SDK. So thank you. Thank you.